Welcome to Daspara Lounge. We're talking about Davida and Choma, the wedding. The question is, why would a lady go ahead and marry a man who has been having multiple flames and even big mamas all through their relationship? Morally, I don't... I'm, I'm totally against shacking up together prior to marriage. I'm against having children out of wedlock prior to marriage. So I just feel the foundation of that union get as it be morally and by the standards of God's word by which I abide. But um, I must say that I seem to be drawn to their love story. I seem to be drawn to the fact that he came from America, went to Babcock University. She came to Babcock University. They met as students. When he really wasn't, you know, all that, fell in love, and they've just been with each other all these years, through thick and thin. I mean, they've been through things that couples of 30, 20 years do not survive. Like what? They lost a child together. Losing, a child, losing a child can destroy relationships. Now, there's always the, a, the tendency to be a blame game. They okay. both went out for a function that day when their baby drowned. Now, other things they had to deal with, a lot of talk of infidelity. There was so much talk about infidelity. Okay, on this. infidelity. It's okay for you to call it infidelity. It's a relationship. We okay. Can, mm. I just wanted to understand, was, what I was talking about, we said so much talk. So what you're saying is that it didn't happen. Okay, there was infidelity. It happened. Oh, okay. There were other baby mamas. In the years she was with him, he had children with other women. He did. In the years she was with him, there were other relationships he had. So, um, personally, if it's my baby girl, I will fight her not to marry that person. Because, as far as I'm concerned, the red flags are just too much. It's not, well, a case of, flag, it's, right? not a, it's not a case of I'm the one wearing the ring, I'm the one he put the ring on the finger, I'm the one he said uh, he's marrying, I'm the one he chose. No, 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 I don't want to be the one you choose in the midst of having so many baby mamas. Do you understand? I want to be exclusive. The only mother of your only children in life, you know? But she made her bed and she decided to, I guess, you know, I saw them together on the wedding day. I saw the dynamics. That guy is crazy about Shoma. Davido is in love. And she is, she practically adores him, looks out for him. There's a way she looked at him. She looks at him and they send messages to each other. You know those kind of couples that can speak with just their eyes? They, are, they, they, they already have that thing going for them. I watched closely. I watched their body language. That guy... So in your final analysis, what are you saying? Uh, hmm, me, Seth, I confused. See, yeah. the guy loves her. She loves him. Let love win. But so, uh, if now my pikino, if Choma is my child, I would fight her not to marry. No but matter you're happy how well, story. no matter you're happy how with that story, but you will fight if it's your child. So which one are you? Which one are you towing? It's not my child now. It's her decision now. I, am I am I invested in the relationship? Do I have anything to lose? Do I have anything to gain? Uh -huh. She made her choice. She will she made her bed, she will lie on it. If David gets up tomorrow morning, all of us online in laws while watching him with corner eye. If he gets up tomorrow and cheats on her, hey, hey. me personally, eh? what I will do to him in the prayer. I'm, so I'm actually confused. I'm actually confused. What do you say? No, see, my own is <laughs> if you have chosen to settle down with Shoma, hmm, then let us believe you what they call that thing, you have sold all your wild oats. Hmm? And this is your final bus stop. Mm? So we don't want to hear mm? you branched. I, I'm going to, I'm writing something. We don't want to hear that you defaulted on your right. vow. Okay. Mm. All right. We okay. don't want to hear that David do. We want to give him the benefit of the doubt that so he has is, made his final decision. That he has made his final decision and he's not going to eh, eh, eh. the other side won't give him the benefit of the doubt i love a love story i think that's a very lovely love story i think she had a lot of haters 
And I think she's very classy. She had in all this. She, oh, 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 the other baby mamas don't like her. It's all the competition. And who go born boy for them? Well, of course, naturally. Who go born boy for him? Who go born? Who go? Uh, who is going to win? Who's going to win the man? You know, who's going to be? Who's going to marry out of yeah, her? Yeah, I think let's let's let let's hear from Oni. Oni, what do you have to say? Oh, okay. I see where you you know the way um what what Ajiri said has shown how subjective we are as a society. For first of all, let me say that. Thank you so much. I, I am not invested in this. Again, like Ajiri said, I, 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 I'm not even an online in-law. This topic yeah, yeah. doesn't pay my bills. Yeah. I don't care. But, but, but since we are discussing it, yes. But, you know, Ajiri's point shows how very subjective society is to, to you know, to issues like this. Um, I wouldn't want to do that, but they've been through so much together. They might as well, yeah, which is fine. What well, what I would say is um she 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 was by his side. We don't know the reason she has stayed with him all these years. Um the no. the most the, the okay, I would like no. to say it's love, but if, if he was poor, would she stay? I don't know the answer to that. If if he was nobody and if he was poor, would we talk about love? Maybe yes, maybe no. Again, no. <laughs> a, 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 again, none, none of these people pay my bills. So, so I'm not invested. Yeah, but if he was poor, we love to say love. I love love too. I mean, who doesn't? But, but if he was poor, like, I, or he was nobody, would we say this love? Would you allow a man continually disrespect you like this? And would we say love? Or well, whatever the answer is, that's fine. But, but be, be that as it may, she I'd has. I'd rather cry in a Bentley. Okay, yeah, yes. Again, of course, people think about that. Of course. Mm -hmm. Um, if you listen to the, if you feel the, the, the temperature on social media, right? Everybody says, you know, the things like men are scum. Men are, I mean, if, if he's poor, it still doesn't mean he wouldn't cheat. So, well, you, you might as well manage this one. At, at least you're guaranteed uh, a secure life or something. There are people who reason like this and, and for them, that's fine. And I know a lot of women who stay with guys who don't have much, who are dead beat dead beat husband dead beat dad but they still don't leave when they're cheating so yeah exactly so it's a lot of things it's a lot it's it's a lot of how society values marriage it's a lot of how society um is is subjective and is um, hypocritical around these things for for instance uh, another example uh, you, you shouldn't move in with a man. You shouldn't have children before marriage. But if he's rich, somehow our voices are not that loud anymore. But I don't approve. If he's rich. I don't approve of the having three children with him before marriage. If, if, I, will have a child. I will never change my stance on that. You understand? No, I'm not talking about you. I'm talking about society. Uh, so, so some things are okay when certain people do them. So some things are okay. So if you we don't we don't shout so loud again. We just we now try to begin to find explanations and all that. Um, and then there was something you said, Aji, that if he steps out on her, that you just want to assume he has sown all his wild oats and all that. And if he steps out, well, um, it, again, we are all internet observers. But I do believe that someone who's, I mean, if he has been stepping out and you are there, I do not believe that a, a, a piece of metal in call the ring or some certificate or whatever it is, or some cultural rights, is going to change that, right? It's going to change that. And we, we don't even know that Chema has any problem with the cheating anyway. I mean, she's still there. Ah, so who so, um, on earth can condone cheating? Which woman? Okay. Which okay. Woman? okay. No, no, I'm just saying, no, you, your, your final point that um, you just assume he's settling down now and all that. And I'm saying, I, I don't quite agree. If someone has been doing something, doesn't want to change, or it's not ready to change, or sees no need to change, and the person they are doing it to has stuck on. Uh, so actually, there's no reason to change. I'm just saying that I don't believe that some piece of signed paper or some metal called the ring, it's going to make a difference. That, that is what I think. Um, There's something about, you know, I mean, Beyonce said it now. If you like you put a ring on it, if you like you put a ring on it. There's something about the commitment of I made vows. Um, I know they've not gone to church yet, but there's something like, I'm the one that drank the wine that she gave me at the at our uh, wine carrying. There's something like her father blessed me to be her husband. There's something like I made a commitment to her father and her mother that I'll take care of her, I'll protect her, I'll be faithful to her. 
there's something quite they're binding. They're married. All these things you're saying is just one one sentence. They're married. There's something okay. quite binding about those commitments, mm. um, madam. Okay, all right. Oh, yes. Okay, so, sorry, so one final thing. So when he runs into these temptations, whatever he goes he to the those and, and this girl. When he runs into the temptation, he remembers he made those vows. He remembers okay. he made those commitments. Okay. okay, so no, if, if, if we go, me, then why do married men me, cheat then? Trust me, every married man, even when they're about to commit the act, even if they remove their rings, they always remember. Those who confess later to their wives say when they are about to do the act. They remember. I mean, I'm, not sure I, I, I'm not sure I understand what you're saying. Did you think no, that no, they were no, forgetting? Wait, wait, but does remembering stop them from doing the act? That is the no. question. Okay. That is the mean... question. <laughs> okay, I, I rest my case. Um, it's uh, yeah. some for some of them it stops them, for others it doesn't. Okay, it's it is, sounds like a joke to me, and this is why we have diaspora lounge so that we can hear you know different opinions. And what I wrote that time, I just wrote confusion overload, and I think that this is the problem that we have from our parts of the world, because I I really cannot understand how. I can stand for something and at the same time i don't stand for it um, i stand for and, and morality and i, and I, I stand think, for high standards but i love a love story I, yeah. and i don't know i don't understand yeah. how this is a love story i really don't understand it you know for you for trauma i can understand how it's a love story you know why because trauma is not you and trauma is not me and i don't know her background i don't know her upbringing and i don't know her values and priorities and you also said something like there's nobody who will nobody will tolerate or nobody can stand cheating. And that's why we have diaspora lounge. The truth is that we're not, we're all different. And you think that cheating is a big deal. Some people do not think that it's a big deal. And I used to be like you, right? Who didn't understand that it's not the same for everybody? For me, it's a big deal. But for Mr. Mrs. C and Mr. C, it may mean nothing. You know why? I understood this just from my friend who told me that from her upbringing, when she was getting married, it would never have mattered to her if her husband was cheating. All she wanted was, is he providing for the family? That means he loves me. That can never work for me. For you, I don't know how you're going to explain it because I'm very sure you will find that you have an explanation for how, how he loves you, right? Well, for me, if you're doing that, I, I cannot accept it. Not, you don't love me and I cannot accept that relationship. But for Choma, it's, 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 this is what she's happy with. So I don't necessarily, I'll, think, I'll never... I don't necessarily think the fact that Choma has no voice whether she's happy or unhappy. But she just married him a couple of days ago. She also, no, she just, she this had, is, we, she, she, she had a child for him. The child got to three years old. And then the child dies and he it makes no her, difference. He, he, pays makes her, difference. he pays her bride price because the, the law, I mean, you are evil. Both of you are evil. Before the child had, dies, he, he did no, not have so many he claims. He had no claims to that child if he did not pay the bride price. He needed to bury that child. And the family was like, you have no claims to this child. I don't understand what you're saying. She got pregnant before he, he paid a bright price. If she, she got pregnant before she had the child. She was there. She had, there were flings already before she had that child. Am I right? I'm saying, no? yes, there were flings and there were baby mamas and there was drama. Lots yeah, so your, your point, I think that your point, your point, she left, I'm, so I'm she missing left it. Once, she left, they broke up once or twice. So don't think she was just a dumbass. She walked out on him once. What, what does that mean? I don't understand what you're saying. I, you know why? Yeah, he begs and she came back. He begs. Yeah. Begs. So I am confused. Like, if if I break up with you once or twice and and I come back to you and you continue Maybe to because continue. I just can't have enough of you. Yeah, just it's my a kid. different thing. That's exactly. So it's a. That's why I'm saying that this is her choice. This is her choice. So I've decided that either I can't have enough of you or really. We don't even know that those are the reasons why why she broke up. She may have broken up because people people are watching, and how can I allow this to happen? But really, 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 if it's a core value of yours, you're going to have to make your priority list. What is most important to you? Because what is the point in my? If she cannot stand it, then she wouldn't marry him. But she can stand it because that's why she's been able to stay through all through with the things, and she's going to be able to stand it 
while he's doing it during the marriage. And I and you just said if he does, oh no no, there will be nothing. Like going that. to depend on him. Nothing I, I don't understand. He won't do it in the marriage. No, it's no, not no, a red David flag. David, no, David, David has um, he has done, he's, he's done with all that in Jesus' name. It's not a red flag. I don't understand your prayer, and he's going to do it. No, no. Three things are sure. It, you say it's a red flag. It's not a red flag because it's an ongoing thing. This is a, a behavior. This is this is the lifestyle for this. Well, he has he has chosen her. He has chosen to. But don't you just ask her. you now? People have chosen and married their wives for 10, 20 years and they're cheating. So what difference does it make? How does that stop anyone from? Like, you, 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 if you could tie up, if you could tie up your statements at somewhere, then I'll be fine. But I, but it, it makes no. I don't understand it. And this is why. You know, the reason we're talking about this is because we're talking about relationships. And we're talking about being in reality and suspending reality. But we're trying to have our cake and it is at the same time. It, 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 it's not possible. We have to accept. I marry this man who I know is philandering. I have to accept that when he does it tomorrow, I'm fine with it. I have to make my peace with it. If, if I decide to marry such a man, I will know that this is what I have chosen. I really cannot wake up tomorrow and say I am angry about it. So you are planning that if he does it, the online in laws will wake up. It, it, I, I don't understand. What are you going we'll to fight finish for? him? We will deal with him. We will throw <laughs> him. We will finish his life. So, we will make him miserable. But I love this. I love this. I love this conversation because I know that everybody speaking here is speaking for a cross section of our society. And we see that this is how we find people who cannot make a choice what they really want. And this is how every choice that they make, this is how it is. Because we want a little bit of this and want a little bit of that. But the, what does even your Bible say? You're talking about prayer. Your Bible says that if you're lukewarm, I will spit you out. You have to make up your mind. Where but you did you even hear him me. when he said that? you know his father told him that he eventually began to sing gospel music so there was, lot of, there was a lot of god in that i don't way. care what there was you a lot say of praise and worship there was a lot of let's pray let's mm -hmm. honor god there was a lot of you know yeah there, there, there's, there's some of, some of us who don't believe in what people say we believe in what we see and we've already seen i mean i have to judge you on your on your precedence and that's what it is so until you do something different so we already know that you are getting ready for you're getting battle ready and you're going to fight because what is coming is coming so get ready for it and you go in that direction so let's leave these people and chama has taken what she what she wants davido has taken what he wants and they're making their lives together i i don't think that anybody has any 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 rights to come let's and say pray for the when he does, let's, will fight let's him. pray for the best let's wish them well and pray i don't understand your prayer actually and leave me out of it you can be doing that prayer i'm not with you on it i, I really and i don't understand it because this is, why, this is why I said that there are only See, more, than 10, more, more than 10 Christians in Nigeria. I because for them. I for yeah, them. because you, you call, in Nigeria, you confuse me with your with your Christianity completely because I, I can't understand it. You know, I don't understand it. So I don't. It's, it's really interesting. It's really interesting. Yeah, I mean, it's interesting. We yeah. just, you know, like, like most internet news, celebrity lives, um, we, we just watch it unfold. No one wishes her bad. No, I mean, no, wh no, why no, would no. I wish her bad? She, she's a sweet girl, and or oh, even if I wish her bad, what do I gain? What? No, again, no. it's celebrity news. We just watch things unfold. Wish them the best and watch things unfold. That's all. Yeah, actually, what I what I even really wanted to happen, which I have already mentioned, is for many years I really thought that nobody. I remember when um, what's his name, Governor of Lagos. I don't remember his name now. When one girl said to me, ah, if if this man would just see me and if this man would just see me and call me and, and marry me. And I was like, what do you mean? Ah, that should be happy to be a second wife. That what am I saying? I said, second wife, why? Eh, that what am I saying? That won't I won't I be her? I said, no, I'm not sharing nothing. And to me, I thought it was odd. And I knew this girl to have several relationships. And I thought it was odd that people would settle for that. Come to find that some people, this is not, it means nothing for them, really. It's not about, I used to think that it was that they accept it because they can't do anything about it. They accept it because, oh, they love him too much and it's painful. But no, some people grew up like that. Because my friend who was telling me this, she said her grandfather had many women and had many children. So to them, 
all the women in the family, they don't see anything wrong with that. But I didn't grow up like that. My I grandfather up, had four wives, and each of the wives had one child for him. Uh, I, maybe that's why you you sway like that and like that. Because I grew up, I grew up in a place. I grew up in a. I grew up in a place, and with my other with grandfather. What was around me? My, my other grandfather, my mother's father, yeah. had five children with my grandmother. And well, she then, don't, you don't know that the things that yeah, happen. You know, brings, yeah. brings my step grandmother in, has other children with him, pushes my grandmother out. Yeah. So to you, because to you, you are you give. A little bit of an excuse to mention. I'm not excusing my grandparents, so my parents. No, were, I don't mean. I don't mean that you're sanctioned. 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 I mean that somewhere in your, somewhere in your subconscious, it's something that men do. In my own subconscious, it doesn't exist. It does not exist, and that's that Nigerian. Mm. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. I'm Nigerian. Different. Excuse me. That's, really? No, no. I don't mean. I don't mean that it doesn't happen. I mean, it happens, but it's not a reality for me. It can never be a reality for me. It can't work. Because also, I will know how to choose a man who, and I will be the kind of woman who a man will not behave like that with. It's hey, got nothing to do with My yes. dear Hal Berry, as beautiful as Hal Berry. It's not about Lou. Her husband stepped out on her. It's, it's not about Lou. It's not about about Lou. It's not about Excuse me, as powerful as Hillary Clinton was, didn't Bill step out on her? Excuse me. So it's not about looks. It's not about powerful. It's not about. It's it's about you being ready to be in a relationship and picking a person who is ready to be in a the type of relationship that you want to be in. That's where it starts. So when oh, you go and okay, pick can somebody, I come in here? yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. You know, we have this, the, the world is changing. I don't know if I'm happy about that or not. Yeah, but I'm happy that the stakes are becoming equal, right? Mm -hmm. So we have these things like as beautiful as Halle Berry was, as exactly. um, beautiful as Hillary Clinton was. Money now, now <laughs> women are exploring the, their sexualities as Even well. Even Princess Diana, as she mm -hmm. finds because yeah, that's not saying. a married woman. She was not a married woman. You need to stop saying that. No, 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 no wait, time. wait. Even even I, I think this we're even deviating from this topic. Child, he preferred the other woman. He preferred the no, woman that he married. Him. Not that he preferred her. He was already in love with that woman before he ever knew his, uh, Lady Diana. So I, I, oh, also, I, also, I, I think you're being, both of you are going to the extreme. Also, you're being sort of <laughs> idealistic, I think. And that you, you're being like... And being what? I, and being what? You, you're being sort of idealistic. I like, um, like saying, now, now you have every right to be what you want to be. Mm. I, I just wish both of you should, could come closer to the middle. We I, 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 I want to believe that the middle is truth. So, Uzo, you're at the extreme end of that totally do wouldn't exist. It's not my reality. I don't know about that. And the jury is at the extreme end of what, well, well, that's what, oh, that's no, what no, men no, do. When you it say doesn't that, even when matter. You that, when you say that, uh, no, 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 that's not what I, because I'm the way you say it doesn't done. matter. I mean, it's a deal breaker for me. We know it is. The, the way you said, no, you, we know you claim that it is. Let's put it that way. Only the way you people said it, you said that I say it's not a reality for me. When I say that, I don't mean that. I don't mean that it doesn't. That I I don't know that it happens. Do you understand? I need to reiterate that. I know it happens every day. I see it. People tell me about their own. Okay. Pain. Welcome to reality. That's okay. what. That's and, what. And, and the reality, Aji, according to you, is, is that men men would step well, out. Most to. men that's, that's would step out no matter. About. Okay. Okay. Fine. I'm just here to say that I'm glad. I don't know if I'm glad or not. That the world is progressing to a point where women too are exploring their own sexualities and not just sitting down and crying over some man and mm -hmm. and 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 that she stepping out and all that it's no longer and um, it's getting to the point where it's no longer the expectation on just the woman because the woman just does have sexual needs the woman does see people who are more attractive than her husband and then you know before we, women couldn't leave because Maybe why will I leave the shame? Women are outgrowing shame. Women are earning their own money. It's not about finances. Women do have urges as well. So I'm I'm just I just popped up to say that if we're at the point where we're still saying a man can't stay, because I don't see the reason where two people can why two people cannot commit to a relationship and somehow it's okay for the man not to be able to do somehow it's okay. We've accepted that, but then it's on the woman because of shame. So I'm happy that the culture of shame now, many emancipated, see, Gen Z and the, the Gen coming after them, even millennials, 
I am glad they are breaking down some things now. So I want to see what next the society will come up with, right? You know, we're mm -hmm. hearing we're hearing complaints now. This woman did this, women are this DNA test, everything. Um, <laughs> women are doing to match men, and you know, I'm just curious to see what else. Did you know what, what else the society country, will come up with? Um, I think that has always been. It's just that maybe people are now more aware because they've been doing it all along. But the reason why nobody knew was because they really did not expect it. And, and I need to the go reason why to, most men don't know that their wives are cheating is because women are very, very smart. Men are I mean, dumb. Men, smart. excuse me, men, men don't know how to hide their rubbish. But a woman can be a woman can be cheating on you. Cool I don't even know cool. where, where we get this kind Look, of a woman thing. can finish you in your house. You're married to her three, four years. She's stepping out. You will never find out. It's not because women even are when, smart. Even when she ends the relationship and she's still in your home, you will never find out. It's not but because man, women are smart. Men leave things on their phone. Men leave evidence everywhere. Yeah. It's not because women are smart. It's because the men do not expect it of the women. And so it, it, it doesn't even cross their minds when something is happening to put two and two together. That's one thing. But I have to go back to this because I won't allow you to put words in my mouth. You say that I said it's not my reality. I don't mean that. You, and you said I should, I'm burying my head in the sand. What do you actually mean by that? What you do don't you mean? want to accept the fact. That what? That's oh, what, what, what is the fact, please? What is the fact? I agree what is the fact, I beg. Tell us. There is fidelity both on men's part and women's part. Are you on this platform with us or are you somewhere else? Did you not hear when I said it? I know that it happens. I'm not saying that it doesn't happen. I am saying that you, you choose the relationship that you want. Do you understand? Well, unless you're saying that no matter who you who it is that you marry, that you will still, unless that's what you're saying. I'm not saying that. that. No, I'm not saying that. Exactly. So that, that's exactly what I'm saying. That There's some saints out there. There's some that's exactly what I'm saying, that I'm not with, I'm not with, with people saying that all men are cheats. Uh, or, or most men are no a man is who he is a woman is who she is i am just saying that i am people do it they find out and they stay and they give reasons and they give excuses i am not doing it should he cheat i am not in the relationship anymore so it's not my reality but you might never find out but that's a different thing how okay let's leave it at that because there, there you are you you when you are going from here to here you and you're not on the, on the path you are going to have a lot of confusion, but if you know where you're going, things will be things will be clearer. I think that's the way to put it. So I'm just going to leave this. I think we should leave this here, unless you have any final word. Otherwise, we're done. Pray for Let's... trauma and David. Pray yeah, you me. can do the prayers. I'm not with you on that. Even though um, I wish them all the best, but I don't know about prayer. I'm not sure where prayer comes into this. I really don't understand. Maybe you can educate me outside of the studio. He can be a changed man. That will be a changed man mm. because of your prayers. <laughs> because of everybody your prayers. cannot change. If that was the case, all the women that have been praying for all the all their men to be changed, why haven't they been? How why haven't but a lot been? of the men change? Okay, you um continue with that story. I I, I understand it. All right then. I think we, we just need we just need inner work. And moments we begin to understand it, but since we're a country full of people, praying people, and people who want to be sentimental and believe, I believe in love, I believe in, and he will change. He's now married, he has a band on his finger, he will remember. All right. Okay, bye bye. <laughs> Leave us with our love. Yeah. Love is sweet, love is sweet. All right, bye. <laughs>